Yeah, <laughs> very cute. Yes, that dog was really cute, and Christina absolutely loves the dogs. Anyway, we were in a place called a Coody, and we just wanted to explore the area and get some breakfast. And then the plan was to head slightly further north and almost complete our trip around the Peloponnese to the national park called Strophelia. I think it's too rainy for that in the Sidbury. We're walking through the Strophelian National Park, which is at the northwest end of this peninsula. It's completely different to much of Greece. We're trying to kind of get a vibe or an idea of all the different um, biomes that Greece has. I find it interesting personally, and it mixes up a bit from just seeing like seaside resort after seaside resort. There's more to Greece than that. They're like mushrooms. Jurassic Park. It's completely different, isn't it? Yeah, there's bees coming out, actually. Let's not uh, disturb them. There's lots of nature here in this beautiful national park. Little tortoises. Come on, fella. He's literally pulling the biggest thing he could find. Walking through the unknown forest and it was pushing me to go first. Yeah, right. Oh, it's so rubbish here. Yeah. And bones, I need. <laughs> oh, there's bones. At least someone explained to me. Oh, there's loads of bones. Loads of bones here. Yeah. To be fair, look. We're flying right. We're, 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 that's alright, only isn't it? Yeah. You wouldn't know, would you? What do you mean? Am I going down here? Yeah. Oh, I don't know. You came in through a headlight. Did I? Yes. I don't know what happened then. <laughs> I asked you if I go straight or was it straight. I couldn't tell. Because the right was red. I just put my I just get a bit. Well that's pretty, it's the most castle. I'm gonna buy a penny for penny boss. Yeah, that got better for this. No, it's an 18 minute. So we threw Peloponnes, crossed the big bridge. Tall was there, wasn't it? 14 euros. 13 euros, 17. 13 euros. 13 euros. 13 euros. 13 euros. Nearly fainted. So we're in Agrinio, yeah? Yeah. Agrinio. And like everyone's looking at us going like, who the hell are these people? What are they doing here? Went to a supermarket and the lady was lovely. She speaks perfect English. And she was saying, what the hell are you doing here? Sort of thing. And uh, we said, oh, we're just driving through. And we just need somewhere to stay for the night. And we came here. And she said, oh, it's like the cheapest city in Greece. So we're going to get some food and have a bit of a laugh. I've had a steak and um, they've given me half and half chips and rice, which is a Welsh thing, or at least it's a good <laughs> thing. In the, def definitely in the valleys, you have half and half. And I've got like plain chips, which is not like these food, but I'm very British, I feel like. Blast is young. Giving us ice cream. Whether it's free or not, I don't know, but. Yeah, it's from, from uh, the. On the house. Mm. Yeah. It's very <laughs> Oh, 
Good morning, Nuni. Tara, home my coast. So the, the only problem like with this, like these towns are, the, the roads are completely, like the lines are completely worn away. Uh -huh. So if you're someone who doesn't know like the roads, you just have to pray that you can kind of see the, lane, the, the lanes you need to be in um, by following other drivers basically. But yeah, I really enjoyed the Greenio. For some reason, like, Obviously, like Christina literally had people looking at her every five seconds just because of blonde. Hey, the point is, I really love that city. Everyone was really friendly and um, it had a buzz about it. There's that nice central square. So, we're at Ancient Thermos. We've just been in the museum nearby. Um, they don't let you film or take pictures in there. We were being followed around all the whole time and we were the only ones in there. And then the Where are we? Group. So, yeah, we're walking through Ancient Thermos. This site is actually really impressive. Um, no one's here, uh, only us. And I thought there'd be more tourists here, but there isn't. In October, I guess it's quiet time, but... But yeah, this, this site goes up, it's quite big, like it's... been going on for ages. And uh, there would have been a big temple here, dedicated to Apollo. But there were other temples as well, like Nike, etc. That's the old, um, museum. Which used to have a lot of the stuff but now it's up in that one I think but uh, that's where they use yes you stole a pomegranate what just happened? when I'm driving carefully 50-60 km an hour around these quite nasty bends and you're not allowed to overtake you know as, as anyone knows in the rules on double double lines you're not allowed to overtake cars I'm about I'm starting to speed up because we're just out past these bends so I'm going like 60 but I'm letting him overtake because that's the right thing to do, you know, like that's the great thing to do because he obviously wants to get somewhere just past the Benz. But there's a cop car hiding around a bush. So he's gone flying past me. No, he wasn't going aggressively fast because I was letting him pass. Like I was going 60 or 50. And I, wasn't... I think it's a 50. So but you're not meant to overtake there. But he was obviously like one, he was always going to overtake me. Let, let's not be around the bush. I didn't like trap him. He was always going to overtake me. Anyway, so he overtakes me. And the cop walks down and goes, right, pull over. <laughs> and he's gonna like <laughs> And I thought he wanted me to pull over as well, so I was like, I'll go over as well. Maybe it's a breathalyzer test or something, you know, something. And he's like, no, no, you that, carry that, that on. Like, no, no, you carry on. We're gonna head to a, uh, the largest lake in Greece, the na largest natural. The deepest. I know, I don't think it's the deepest. Yay, he's doing it! Good as Oli, how was it? Normal now. It just like I said, you go you like that, and it's quite gradual. Then wait till it's darker, I don't know if you can see it. It just goes bang. Like it's like it goes like a foot a foot deep. Well for every foot you go out it goes about deeper by a foot. It really is quite steep. Apparently it's fifty eight metres deep, I can believe that. That's the problem with going it. It's not probably proper ready, but so sweet. Yeah, I did, yeah. Castle Griever, here we come. It's weird how some castles just get left to their own devices and others have lots of tourism around them. It's amazing. Yes, there's a nice view from the top of this castle, isn't it, Christina? Yeah. Yeah. Very nice. It's so gorgeous, red.